The boy comes to sell eggs, but he's telling stories, yeah? Taking time to <laughs> sell stock the other way. <clears throat> and then, Sevilla Flood got malaria, the girl who was telling story to the boy who sells eggs. And he got, she got pregnant. And she gave birth, but he, she died. She died. Missionary died. You know why missionaries, uh, you never know if you are coming back alive. My parents were missionaries in uh, Thailand. They were missionaries in Africa. You never know when they're coming, if they are coming back alive. <clears throat> she died. The husband buried the, the, the wife. And she, he lost faith. He went home. Now, <laughs> all Adventists there in the whole country, why are there 100,000 Christians in the country? Yeah, because of that boy. Everything that the woman told that boy, he told to the parents and everybody in the community. Now there are Christians. Sibeya Flat doesn't, he doesn't, she doesn't know because she died. When she wakes up, when Jesus Christ comes, then people will say, we, we know we are from the country where that boy was uh, preaching us who you were selling eggs to. Uh, you were buying eggs from and telling story, yeah? So even, just do, even if we don't see, because the Bible says, <clears throat> the word will not come out empty, yeah? Put, cast your waters upon, uh, cast your bread upon all waters and it will not come empty, empty. Okay. <clears throat> Nevertheless, if I tell you, it is expedient that I go away, for if I go not, the Comforter will not come unto thee. But if I go and depart, I will send unto you. And he is, when, when he is come, he will reprove the world of sin and of righteousness and of judgment. Okay, let's pray. Our Father in heaven, thank you, Lord, for the promise of the Holy Spirit, for the solution to our problems, our sin our sinful natures, our sins, for forgiving us for our sins and being capable of transforming our lives. We only ask that you help us to be humble, help us to be submissive to you, and to believe, have faith in you, and to truly depend on you and, be, uh, and ask you for guidance and leading. Thank you for hearing our prayers. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.